Hi there, Kay here from Fresh Start Ayurveda. And today I was just going to introduce a little concept from Ayurveda, from the philosophy of Ayurveda. And that is the five elements. And then according to Ayurvedic philosophy, everything in the whole universe, including you, is made up of the same five elements. And so we see it at the beach here. Um, so we have lots of space, which is the first element. And um, we all need space. We have space everywhere in our bodies, in our bone cells, and every cell in the body, and in our tubes and passages. If we didn't have space, we would just be solid blobs. So space is really important. And in, in order for anything to exist, we first need space. So once the space is there, we can create. Um, and the next thing we need is movement and air because air brings life to everything. So the air is the next thing. So here we have lots of space and a gentle breeze. And after that, we need fire. We need the warmth of the sun. Without the warmth of the sun, nothing else can exist. Every single chemical process depends on the, the heat of the sun. Um, so, it, or it involves the heat of the sun, shall we say. Um, so everything on earth, without the sun, without the fire in our body, without the, the, the warmth and the heat, um, we wouldn't be able to see as well. So we've got and a, a lovely um, sunset happening around the corner. You can't quite see it from where I am right now. Um, and then the, the next element, once we um, have heat and space and movement and air, we, we need water. So plenty of that going on here. Um, the tide's coming in right now. I've just been for a lovely swim. It's beautiful. Um, and then after water, is, brings water comes into the body and it nourishes all our cells. It nourishes um, our tissues and it takes, it takes the nutrients from one place to the other. It lubricates and it um, helps to remove waste from the body as well has so many functions and as you probably know we are mostly water and then finally we need the earth element so you can see here lots of that going on stones and sticks and hillsides everything solid is made from the earth and everything that we um, need to grow and to build all our tissues comes from the earth so those are the, the five elements of Ayurveda and I will be building on that to explain how those five elements combine together to create the doshas. You probably have heard of doshas and you may have even taken a dosha quiz or 10 and got all muddled up online as we all have a history of doing that. But I'll try and simplify the doshas so you can figure out how the doshas dance within you um, and uh, to see which doshas are most prominent in you at any one point in time. And once you understand that, then you understand how to start balancing them. Okay, great. So that's the five elements or the Panchamaha Bhutas as they're called. And uh, we'll see you next time. Thanks. Bye.